first saw it, I wondered how it would work. Um, I was a bit sceptical, but um, I thought, well, I'll give it a try. And um, I've been really pleased with the results. Did it take you many tries to uh, get used to it or see how you could use it? No, it didn't take many tries at all. I mean, what, what I do is um, every pupil who comes in who's a different level, I, I try it at the beginning of the lesson and we do some exercises and then take it off and see how they carry on with the, the rest of the lesson. And then if I think I need to put it on again, I do. But it's teaching them how to keep the bow straight and make a good sound. So I'm, I'm all for it. What sort of lessons or exercises do you, do you give them to try? Um, I start with some very long, um, long bows so that they're going very slowly and they try and keep the angle of the arm at the right angle on the up and down stroke. And then I try some quick little exercises as well. Um, so they're playing faster notes so they're controlling it more in the middle of the bow. When you're setting them homework, what kind of mix of with or without the bozo do you ask them to do? Um, well, to start off with, I teach them how to, how to play the piece, how to understand the rhythm and where the notes are with the left hand. And then I ask them to put the bozo on and practice with the bozo for five minutes and then take the bozo off and practice for another five minutes without it and try and do it regularly through the week. Have they all managed to take it, to put it on and take it off successfully? Yes, yeah, there hasn't been a problem. I mean, I've got little six and seven year olds who can put it on and take it off. So, yes, I, might, I use it with all my uh, different standards of pupils, really. So it's not just beginners. Do you use it with adults as well? I do use it with adults, yes. Um, and from t time to time, it's good for the advanced players to put it on and just check that they are keeping it straight, because there's so many things to think about when, when they're playing a piece of music. It's quite hard keeping your, your arm at the right angle. It, it, how do um, people who are more advanced at playing use it? Do they look into a mirror or what? How would they use it to check their technique? Um, yeah, look, in, look st stand side onto a mirror and, and check. Right, just see it's going through at so 90 degrees. To see if it's going degrees. up the 90 degrees, yeah.